A while back, we produced a video on how you could remove clickable hyperlinks from Apple Notes whenever you created them on an iOS device like your iPhone or your iPad. Now, whilst the fix worked back then on newer versions of iOS like iOS 15, it doesn't work anymore. So since a lot of people have commented, they've messaged us, they've asked for a solution that works in iOS 15, we had to come up with something. So I found a workaround that'll stop these addresses or URLs or phone numbers from automatically becoming a clickable hyperlink. Now I have to say up front though, before we receive any comments, this isn't an ideal solution because it does involve extra effort, but at least it's something you can do until Apple fixes the issue and produces a version of Apple Notes that allows us to decide if we wanna prevent text from automatically becoming a hyperlink. So here's the problem. In iOS 15, Apple Notes, if we enter in a URL like www.test.com and save the note, Apple Notes turns it into a clickable hyperlink because it sees this string of text as a URL and that's fine and you might want that, but I'm obviously guessing you don't because you're here watching this video. You don't want it clickable and that's where our problems begin. So since Apple provides no way to turn this off, we'll try anything. And I'm sure most of you listening already have. So if we try to do something to this link, let's say we'll put a space at the end and we'll click out of that. It's still a link. If we attempt to put a space at the front and click away, it's still a link. If we go and do something else like put a dot at the end, it's still a link. And if we try the obvious other one to put a dot at the front, it's still a link, even if we try to put something else like a, a letter at the end, that's still a link. And of course, if we do the same at the front, it's still a link again. So, and in any event, any of these options just looks dumb and it doesn't read properly. This thing is so frustrating. So here's the solution that I've found. Now, even though I just demonstrated that a space, effectively a blank space doesn't work, I discovered if I paste a specific Unicode blank character at the end of our text. So let's do that. And then go ahead and delete the space that gets added at the front when we paste something. You can see it there. It is hidden between our hidden character and our URL. You can't really see it, but it is there. So let's hit delete. And now when we exit out, there's no link because our hidden blank character has broken the text string that Apple Notes determines to be a link, in this case, a URL. And to be clear, it's not a space, it's actually a legitimate blank character. This is really important. We can't see it, but it is there. And that's it. Yeah, I can hear already what a pain to have to do that, and I agree. However, it's hopefully a temporary solution to a problem Apple themselves will one day fix. I just wouldn't hold your breath though, because it wasn't fixed in iOS 14, so we might be waiting a while. Now you might be wondering, where can you get this miraculous hidden blank character? Well, in anticipation of that very question, I've searched the web to find a location that makes it easy for you guys to cut and paste this most special of characters, and you can get it from the appropriately named invisibletext.com website. So if you come here and you choose this button, that's gonna copy the invisible Unicode character to your device's clipboard, whether that be the iPhone or iPad, and then just go ahead Paste that into your note, remove the added space at the start, which Apple Notes does that automatically, and like magic, your link is gone. Now, let's do that again. Let's do it on a number. This time we'll say 99998888, and I apologize ahead of time if that's your phone number. Now, you can see if I X out of that, it's clearly converted into a link. So let's add in our invisible character. Let's just paste that in. We'll remove the added space. Let's get out of that. And again, it's no longer a link. So that works fine there as well. Now, if you do plan on using this special blank character as a method of removing your hyperlinks though, I'd probably make your life a little bit easier by simply going ahead and creating a new note. Since it's already on our clipboard, we can just paste it in there. So it's now just a simple copy and paste a way for you to use it at any time you like, just in case you lose that original website link. And if you wanna make it one less cut and paste, well, you could use a text replacement for the space and that'll automatically get inserted whenever you type something else. So this is what I mean. Let's go to our settings. We're going to choose general. We'll find our keyboard option. We'll go to text replacement and tap plus in the top right. And we'll have two fields here, a phrase and a shortcut. So for the shortcut, we're gonna type in what we want 
to be replaced with our space. So I'm just going to type in LK short for link. You can call it whatever you like. And in the phrase, we're going to paste in our blank character. Now, it didn't look like it did anything, but it's there. So let's click Save. And let's go back to our note. And let's remove the spaces here so you can see that our phone number is still a link again. And I'll type in space and LK, which is obviously our shortcut. We'll hit space. And you can see that shortcut has kicked in and replaced it with the hidden character. Now, we will still need to delete the Apple added space so it's no longer a link again. And if we exit out of that, you can see our link is now gone. Now, if you do choose to use this text replacement method, the good news is it's automatically going to sync to your alternate device, such as your iPhone in this case, because I'm using my iPad. So you only have to do it once. So that's the workaround for this issue. It's not a permanent solution, mind you. I, like many of you, are still looking for a permanent one. But for now, this is a method of being able to stop annoying automatic hyperlinks in an iOS 15 note. So I hope you enjoyed the video. See you all next time. Have a great day.